Hello friends. Here is another episode from your favorite YouTube channel Merlin Scholarship and Immigration Class. In today's video, we talk about the bitter truth of visa delays and rejection. We are just making sure we educate you with all you need to know about some countries so as to enable you to make wise decisions while making a choice of country to migrate to in search of greener pastures. We will also be guiding you on available job offers in those countries and scholarship sponsorship if your aim is to study in the country. All will be given out through this channel for free. So to learn and benefit from all this teaching kindly subscribe to the channel, share the videos to your families and friends and don't forget to click on the notification bell above to get notified on my next video which will soon be published. Now we have to get into the teaching proper hoping you have subscribed with us. So if you are interested in this video then you have to watch to the end as I left some vital information at every stage of the video as I give you all immigration updates. The reason most foreigners like Nigeria and India have to endure a long time delay for a Canadian visa and according to some interview and conversation I had with some of them, we noticed that the time of this visa processing increased as a result of the COVID-19 pandemic outbreak. And this delays increased to more than 200 days instead of the usual 60 days. And the report from the Common Standing Committee on Citizenship and Immigration claims that between 2016 and 2022, that more than 500,000 applications for student visa in Canada were denied. In the same report, several of these applicants were qualified for, accepted for, and frequently financed under Canadian research grant and scholarship but the Canadian Immigration and Citizenship have decided to keep the visa application on hold. It's made to know that these delays also happen to students who are already in Canada and studying in Canada, who are just applying for standard and encouraging postgraduate work. The delays are causing concern and anxiety to students and others who are currently studying in Canada due to the university inability to execute scholarship or employment payment without a valid visa or study permit. While Canadian Immigration and Citizenship have implemented employee training program and other steps to combat racism and ways and accountability are needed for more equal practice given. In this current time the High Canadian Committee recently said that they recognizes the frustration and anxiety of Indians and Nigerians who are experiencing delays in receiving their visa and pledges to keep trying to reduce the time taken for visa processing and others will also be put in a good place for immigrant. They further said, we acknowledge your anger and frustration and want to reassure you that we are making a good effort to make things better. Moreover the Canadian High Commission said that they have been reviewing applications all year long including those for study visas for the September 2022 intake and above. Let me know in my comment region and don't forget to subscribe and share with your loved ones.